So, I uh, finally hit level 98. I'm a few, few weeks behind most of my server. Um, so I can finally do the Floor 24 Conflux levels. Um, air, Fire, and Chaos. The same strategy I've been using forever. Easy peasy. Didn't even change emblems or rosters, just ran it quick. It took like 30 seconds each. However, Water got kind of tricky around Floor 20. Um, so a Galu melee build doesn't work anymore, which was a really quick and easy way to do it because of this right here, Cold Domain. So all melee, every second, take some damage and they have their attack and attack speed decrease. So you won't be able to kill her or burn through her shields. Um, so going back to Mephala, which who's also... I used the first few levels before I switched to Galu for everything. Now the main reason we're using Mephala is obviously to ult the ranged, because the ranged are out of range of his removing, um, or his lowering it's every second adding a stack of lower attack and attack speed. However, she also is helpful because um, her stone skin, because of a specialty, yeah, her four star, which would be awesome if other people could do it, but so her stone skin removes all their debuffs. So um, every 15 seconds, we can clear all the melee's debuffs. So they'll still be doing some damage, but not enough to take her out. Um, and then I marked her with fast attack. I'm guessing that'll be ideal. And um, her all I don't know. I have her kind of leveled up. You don't need her that leveled up, but you need your all, her alt long enough to protect the blast against all the ranged. So I'm using... Um, I'm not doing any burn. I'm, I'm going all bleed because you need burn bleed to get through the shield. Um, I'm going to try it with my Pegasus who's like level 60 something. She sucks. I could use a mercenary Pegasus what I did the last level. Um, because she applies bleed. Orcs apply bleed. I'm bringing the regular two sharpshooters just for damage in between the shields to speed things up. Um... Dendroid bleeds if he's being hit, and he slows for the double strikes from the archers. Um, Behemoth bleeds, but not on every attack. Not that great of a bleed. Like uh, Minotaur and Centaur bleed on every attack. But he's tanky. And since they've added backup units, you can't put backup units in tanks. So I, I took the Angel out and uh, put her in backup. So him, so if I... Get to the point where my backup troops spawn. No, res some people. Gog just gets burns up. I don't know if it'll, they'll even... I don't know how hard this is going to be. It might not even proc my... Um, probably not, because usually lose the time on this. Um, but in any case, Wyvern, mine's only 5-star and not all the way leveled up. It's really handy. Because you're doing debuffs, he does extra damage against all debuffs. And... Um, he does extra, Plague does extra damage against bleeding targets. And then also reduces healing, which the mummy does, mummy does as well. So I'm bringing him because of uh, this ability here. Every two seconds it heals a little bit. Apparently he's a guy. I thought it was, always thought it was a chick. But it says him. Maybe translation's just horrible. Oh yeah, it always is in this game. So anyway... That's the gist of the strategy. Um, that constant healing by dampening that with plague and a, and a mummy will save time. It's a race against time. Let's give it a shot. Okay, so... Um, if you're watching this because you're stuck after, at level 20 or 21 or whenever it changes, um, and yeah, I haven't used my follow before, just a reminder that uh, she'll have a little graphic, and that's when you want to alter your ranged. That one right there. Ooh, did I miss it? No. Now, oh yeah, I'm going through that shield pretty quick. I only have three casts of Rush Tactic. Oh, that was way easier than last time. Stone skin, clear the buffs. Um, if your alt is in his level, is what I was saying, um, for as long of a duration, 
you want to cast it right with the little animation wings forward. Last time I was clearing this with like seconds left. But so yeah, if you want, if you build for it and you know what's happening, I wonder if it must be that stopping that healing that's making such a difference. Then uh, she's not too hard. If you're not getting through the shields quick enough, add more burn bleed units. If you're not killing her fast enough, oh, I lost my sharpshooters. Um, I add more DPS. Didn't seem that hard, but only two of the 98s on my server have done it, and there were some hard ones before this. Next up, Earth. Or at least I hope so.